That was a baby snap. That kind of, I, I need to come in here. Uh, we are the Soul Brothers. How you guys doing? Back with a versus video. It's cold as fuck. Yeah, it's, it's kind of me. It's it's kind of brisk. Oh, you, you know what? It's hot outside, but you got the AC cranking. Yeah, I do. Which is nice. Very nice. Um, let's hop in on this versus video. This is the Kyrie <coughs> 3 versus... The Heeper Dunk. Heeper Dunking? Heeper Dunking 2017 React. Okay, uh, let's hop in on the Traction. Ooh, this Ooh. is... I don't know, man. What's better? Stopping power, I feel like they're both the same. Maybe the Kyrie 3 will just by a little bit. Well, then the Kyrie 3 is going to win. Want to know why? Why? Because you can use these outdoors. Mm. But indoor use. Yeah, who I don't cares know. about outdoors, guys? Yeah. I mean, like, I we don't really play outdoors that much. Yeah, like, sometimes. what is this in the 1940s? <laughs> yeah, the 40s. No, I'm joking. I'm joking, guys. Uh, but I, um, yeah. But for those of you who play outdoors, yeah, the Kyrie Three is better. But indoors, where we mostly play, uh, stopping power, I'd say, uh, is about the same yeah. which is really good but yeah. the Kyrie 3 maybe just a little bit but not really dust wise also uh they're both really good you don't really have to wipe yeah. um it's kind of weird because like this white colorway is really good yeah but then the flying it was it picked up a good amount of dust which is weird but yeah um and I don't know, this is a tough yeah one. and this one also kind of has like a curve in the outside yeah. right here so i they're both really Should good just call it a tie yeah, I think we should tie it. Yeah, let's just tie it. They're both really good. Okay, moving on to the cushion or lack thereof. Um, this is what this shit is garbage. There's a zoom unit in here, uh, but it's just super stiff. Yeah. The response is crazy. Obviously, you're pretty low to the ground. Heel to toe transition isn't actually the best. I mean, it's good, but it's like. It's kind of hard here, you know? Kyrie, I know you're watching this video. Please talk he to Leo Chang. Every video we do. Please talk to Leo Chang or whoever the designer is on your next shoe, the Kyrie 4 or whatever, and change it to React Cushion because this is still very responsive, but you get a good yeah. amount of impact protection. Yeah. This, I'm done with this shit. Yeah, this shit is violent. This I don't want it. Teeth chattering. Um, you know, you can get a concussion. You, mean, you don't even have to hit your head. Yeah. Um, so React is better. Of course. Okay. Now moving on to the upper. Um, okay. This is the regular. This is not the fly knit. Nope. Keep that in mind. But this still is very, 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 um, well, just as far as materials go, you know, they're just very synthetic, stiff, um, in the Kyrie. Yes. Very supportive, but we'll get into that. Uh, these are better. Of course. You know, yeah. The, the hyperdunks are better as far as material wise. Um, okay, fit. 2017 wins. True size. True to size on both. Yeah. Um, it does run a little bit long though. Mm. So if you have a skinny ass foot, maybe try it half a size down. Yeah. These both run really. This one runs pretty narrow. Yeah. The Kyrie actually. It so, does, yeah. Um, there's that. Uh, what are we talking about now? Support uh, thing. Support. They're both good. But this shit is crazy supportive. It is crazy supportive, but this is really good support too yeah. because it the, the material doesn't stretch at all. So I give it a tie. Tie it up. But if you're a big guy, I feel like the Kyrie 3 has a little bit better of a material for that. Mm -hmm. But, you know, for me, it's both yeah, good. Yeah, adequate. All right, um, lockdown. Lockdown. Tie that shit up. Tie it up. Wait. Wait. I mean, I mean, the Kyrie's got to be heavier. I don't know, is it? It's pretty light. Twelve point oh three. The Kyrie is probably twelve point five. Ooh, twelve point five six. Ooh. So the Hyperdunks are lighter. Yeah. What feels lighter to me, the Hyperdunks, mm. uh, because uh, the, just the material is just so thin. Yeah. It's really nice. You the know? shoe is a. It, it's it's so. Uh, the upper is so strong and sturdy that it almost feels like like a little like a boot yeah but it's still crazy responsive but you know so there's that um what else let's talk about durability Kyrie's Kyrie's for the win uh ventilation hyperdumps hyperdumps for the win a by a little bit yeah uh aesthetics Kyrie's for me Kyrie's all right these don't look bad though for me all right now uh moving on let's just wrap it up okay 
This shoe is at the one hundred and uh, twenty dollar. Twenty dollar, very cheap. Very uh, cheap one for a basketball shoe. Yes. Um, it's pretty cheap. And then the Hyperdunk is one forty, so it's only twenty bucks mm -hmm. more expensive. And the uh, the lows, if you want to get the lows, because this has no ankle support, so this should basically be yeah. low. And this if this little slab of material that goes up here is worth nothing. 10 bucks ain't doing nothing yeah, I guess. It doesn't do shit five dollars so. each, each, each shoe. <laughs> yeah so um uh so yeah if you get the lows it's only ten dollars more is what i'm saying it's not yeah. that big of a price difference and uh what performs better of course i like the hyper for the win. i mean i feel like this is a better version of the Kyrie's because yeah. the traction is just amazing it has this outsole curvature a little bit uh it has a pivot point it does have a pivot Which point. Which we like from the Kyrie's. Yes, and uh, the cushion is very responsive, but impact protection is there, mm -hmm. uh, unlike in the Kyrie's. Yeah. Materials are way better. It's still very supportive, uh, a lot softer. Uh, fit is nice. So I this is a really responsive, fast feeling shoe. Yeah. And for me, it feels way better than the Kyrie's. Yep. Yeah. Uh, so there you go. Big win for the Hyper Dunk. A uh, very good shoe. Definitely suggest you cop that. Soul Bros. We'll catch you in the next one later. Peace.